Hi, third grade. It's Wednesday morning. Uh, you'll find this funny. This is the third time I've recorded this video. Um, the first time I did it without uh, any sound. And the second time, the fire alarm went off. No reason. They were just testing it. And so that and just kind of screwed up the middle of it. So I'm going to hope that this is the third time is a charm video. All right. So hopefully you have um, in the instructions we said cut out the secret code cards before you watch the video. If you have not done yet, so yet, please do so. You'll find them on page 219A through um, D, and you'll see that there's two separate pages. You're gonna wanna cut them out on the dotted line. Don't cut both at the same time because they don't match, okay? So if you've cut those out, then you can continue this video. If not, go ahead and stop it and um, do that and come on back. All right, so um, I want to, before I go to today's lesson, I want to just review it really quickly in yesterday's lesson that we had place value drawings because we're going to see some place value drawings on those secret card codes. So we're going to start with number two, and we see that's one, two, three, four, four ones. So we're going to put four in the ones. Those are, we call them dots or circles. And then we have two sticks. Each stick stands for 10, so that's two tens. And then we notice that 10 sticks together makes a square, and so that makes 100, so 124. Then we also are gonna to go to this one. We're gonna do the same thing, but these they're using the actual sticks and dots and blocks. So one in the ones column, six tens, and three hundreds, 361. Number six, same idea, one, two, three, four, 400. And then we're gonna look, and so four tens, and then nine ones. And this one you guys didn't have to do, we didn't make you draw it, but I'm gonna draw it for you. 587 would be five of the blocks, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, with that space in the middle, and so eight tens, and then seven ones. We group the five and the six and the seven there. All right, so that was that page. And then this is the one that most of you, or not most of you, several of you missed. So I sent those, um, that, I might have sent that assignment back to you. Um, this one, you'll notice that here we have a thousands, hundreds, tens, and ones, but this one does not. So when we have a place where there is no place value, we need to put a digit that represents not having any of those place values. So the number that, re the digit that represents that is a zero. So here we have 1,000, and then we don't have any hundreds, so we're gonna put a zero in there. And then we see five plus another four, nine, tens, and three ones. And then you're gonna yell at me if I don't put the comma in there, so there you go. All right, and then if we were drawing for this number, we would have five of those lovely, I'm gonna put one over here, there we go, five of the thousands. We don't have any, there's a zero there, so no hundreds, and then one ten, and then our seven, ones there you go um, and then we had you do so write the words for numbers for the word names so we had 82 we had 99 we had 467 906 so there's that 900 and then there's no tens so we have to put that zero there same thing here 1015 no hundreds so there's a zero and then 8120 but without that zero for the ones then we would not have the correct number we'd only have 812 we know that's incorrect all right so those are yesterday's and so today we're going to be our learning target is to read three digit numbers and build two and three digit numbers with some secret code cards so you should have cut those out so i'd like you to look through your uh, secret code cards and have 372 and while you you can pause me at any time so that you can find those but i'm going to go ahead and point out 372 here and so you should find the card that says 300, the card that has 70, and the card that has two. So again, you can pause me if you need to. I'm gonna go ahead and keep going. So the, you're gonna hear some words today. You're gonna hear standard numbers and expanded numbers. So when we put the number out like this, it's expanded. We've, we've pulled them all out. So 372. Now when you look on the back of a secret code card, you're gonna notice there's some place value drawings. So there's one, two, three, 300, um, 300s. And then 70, you're gonna notice that it has seven tens, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70 there, and two dots for the two ones. So there's 372, and this is our expanded version. You're also going to notice that when we have it like this way, we can see all of the place values there, so that's expanded. But when we go to a standard number, 
We're going to put them on top of each other and they're all going to line up on the right hand side here. And you're going to have 372. Now this is what we call the standard number because this is how we most often see numbers. And each of these digits has a value and up in the left hand corner you're going to see that value. This 2 is a value of 2. This 7 is, has a value of 70 and this 3 has a value of 300. So when we look at them that way, that's our standard number, and then we look at it this way, it's our expanded number, all right? And if we didn't have any, seven, if we didn't have any, um, if we didn't have that card there, and we just had, we didn't have any tens, then we would just have 302, like that, all right? So I'd like you to also now find 184. You can pause me if you'd like. 184, I'm gonna go ahead and pull them out, 180. 4 and 100 and the 80 and the 4 and again this is the expanded version when we put them on top of each other we get the standard version and so we look and look at those values so 4 stands for that four ones and you can see them on the back there's our four ones eight that that eight stands for 80 which again is our eight tens and the hundred is our one little hundred here that way but again expanded form whoa upside down and there and then when we put them together they are the standard form so you're going to use your secret code cards to do some work today um, we're in fact going to go over a couple of the problems together that you're going to experience um, and type in on your um, on your assignment today so it looks like this except for it's half and half um, so let's go over the first one so we have 300 plus 20 plus 4 so you're going to find that in your secret code cards and then you're going to put them on top of each other for that standard number, which is 324. Then you're gonna find 700s, you're gonna find the 700 card. You're gonna find 610, so you're gonna find the 60 card. And then you're gonna find the five ones, and you're gonna put them on top of each other and find 765. Then down here, you're gonna do this in two ways. You're gonna do, first, the way is the expanded form, like up here. So you're gonna get 272 in your card, secret code cards, and you're gonna find 200 plus 70, plus two. And then you're also going to do it this form. So you're going to say two hundreds, I'm gonna have to type in that with the letters, plus 70, but you're not gonna put 70, you're gonna put seven, because that stands for seven what? Seven tens, and then plus, and then two, two, and you're gonna put ones as well. You're gonna label each of those. So that's how you're going to work on today's assignment. Make sure you use your um, secret code cards to complete the slides and help yourself out there. Um, I just want one more quick thing. Um, if you are using your computer, you're going to notice that, oh, upside down. Um, you're, if you're trying to get your pluses and your equals in there, um, just remember that uh, the plus is when you use your shift from your pinky from your other hand and use your pinky from this hand, you can get a plus. You have to have the shift down to get the plus. If you don't have the shift down, it will be equals. All right, friends, um, I hope you have a great day and I hope you um, have no problem turning, the, don't forget to turn in the assignment on the extra tab and I will see you tomorrow on math.